A massive solar farm in Austin is going to be used to charge a fleet of 200 all-electric Capital Metro buses. Now, this is a story we first told you about yesterday on KXAN News at 4. KXAN anchor Tom Miller talked with Austin Business Journal reporter Mike Kristen about what to expect. How is this project going to transform where we are now, the North Austin bus station? Well, uh, so Cat Metro is partnering with a renewable energy company, Holt Renewable. They're based here in Austin. And what they're going to do right here is erect a 12-acre uh, large canopy, essentially, that will be covered in solar panels, a total of 7,000 solar panels, uh, to charge a, a coming fleet of electric buses for, the, for Cat Metro. And how will these chargers work, and is there anything else like this right now? So there are examples all over the world of charging stations. Uh, just doing a quick internet search, you'll see that there's uh, uh, facilities from India all the way to, to Maryland that have sort of similar technologies. I haven't seen anything to this scale yet, to be honest. I mean, we're talking about 12 acres of solar panels. So it's a really large uh, facility. When could we see this go live? And what are the long-term plans for sort of the electrification of the fleet here? Sure, so uh, Cat Metro has a, a definitive plan to move all of its vehicles to electric by 2030. Um, and that also coincides with the city of Austin's plan to also have a zero emissions fleet by uh, 2040. Mike Kristen with the Austin Business Journal talking electric buses with us. Thank you, Mike. Thanks, Tom.